Good evening, everyone. This is Luke H. with a BBWO podcast, and it's been forever, so I'm going to give you the full season update on what's been going on. 13 games have been played, and just as predicted, the competition has been tight. The Fightings are in first place with a 7-6 record, which is really close to the 6-7 and seven Metmares. So that being predicted was practically correct. But since there's only... Five players that have played in this league for the majority. Because Rocco C made his debut but only played one game. But five players have mainly played and since it's such a low amount. We're going to go by player by player and give them a recap on how they perform so far in the first 13 games of the season. Let's start off with Matt B. Matt B has been nothing but amazing. I think... He is practically having a 2012 Luke H season. Exactly. He's leading the league with home runs, batting average, and RBIs. Same as Luke H did last year. And on the mound, they're pretty similar last year. Both throwing quite a bit of walks, but with a similar ERA. Matt is right now 3.83, but he is pitching phenomenal on the mound. And has worked in a screwball, which has really helped him turn into a better pitcher. Nick B has been having an Ike Davis type season. Pitching on the mound has improved, but his hitting has not been to where it is. He's hitting. Oh, fuck. His batting average right now remains at 1.146, which is not expected. He has taken two deep and only has seven hits and 48 at bats, striking out 27 times. His pitching has been great. He's 2-2 two two on the mound. And his defense has not been quite there as it has been compared to last year. But he's been a helpful resource for the Fightings through their season so far. Josh H. and Jake H. got traded. But Josh H. is having the best season. Easily an MVP candidate. He's hitting 293 with six home runs. And on the mound, he's 3-2. He is just... Definitely an MVP candidate. Definitely broke out last year. It took him like 25 at bats to get his first hit. Now he's hitting 293 with, I believe, 19 hits. Actually, 17. But he's been hitting phenomenal. His OPS is above 1,000. And his slugging is .689. And he has struck out less than anybody else in the entire made, into in the entire BBWO, just like last year. So he is on pace of being another MVP candidate, all-star player. Now, let's go to the Met Mirrors. Well, Josh is the H is a Met Mirror, but let's go to Jake H. His season has been the way it's expected. He has eight home runs, tied in second place. He's been slugging it out. His pitching has been a little off, though. He's giving up a lot of home runs, but he's been successful at times. But his bat has been pretty good. Despite having a 208 batting average, he is a great advanced stack player while playing for the offense. His on base percentage, or OPS, I should say, is .958, and he has a slugging percentage of .564, which means. He has a great on-base percentage of 3.90, I would have, 3.96, 3.90s, because that stat has not been updated yet, and it will be later tonight on the website, so check that out when available. But Jay Gage has been having a great offensive season, and that's a fact, just as expected. Now let's go to the most talked, well not the most talked, but one of the most improved players in the league, Lou Gage. Last year he was throwing, he had a whip of 3.14 last year. This year he dropped it down to 140, excuse me. <coughs> this year in 14.1 innings he has struck out 36, walking 15, and only giving up 5 hits with a 3-1 record and an ERA of 1.88. He has already thrown a no-hitter, and he shattered the BBW strikeout record 3 times this year. He has... The current record of 9 strikeouts through 3, and he's also k 7 twice. There's nothing stopping him. He has one loss, but other than that, he is an animal on the mound. In his last 6 innings, he has struck out 14 batters, 
walking only one. So, that's proving he, his command has definitely increased greatly because he is definitely right now, I'm, right now, no choice to Sayang. His batting numbers <coughs> have been a little down. He's saying 314 with a 632 on base percentage. His OPS is 16.32, which means his slugging is a thousand exactly. He has eight home runs, and he's only struck out 12 times. His bat's a little off. He's kind of having a map B offensive season, but of well, an offensive season of him last year. My bad, but you know he has been on fire, and he's living up to the numbers he's been projected to. And same with Matt B and all the other players. Pretty much almost everyone is accurate. <coughs> Soon, also, there's a couple announcements. Since for the Met Mirrors, Luke H has announced that he is going to be a closer every other week for the Fightings. One week, I mean for the Met Mirrors, my bad. He'll pitch one inning in one week, twice. So he'll pitch two innings in for a week, and then the next thing he'll start and then close. So it's gonna be a little awkward, but it just we just want to see how he's gonna do because that's actually how he's been doing it for most of his career, and he's been great that way. So he wants to go back to see if he can get more outs quicker and such. But overall, it's gonna be a tight competition. We all know it. Second halves here, it's definitely gonna be great. So. Thank you for watching. This is Luke H. signing out. Have a good night, everyone, and stay healthy.